A month ago, this is a normal scene, a rally, full of people of all ages, beliefs, and ideas. But this is no longer normal, and that's what brings these people together. It's about time to rise up and say enough of this. Brenna Garris says she went from full-time work to part-time. Her kids are no longer in school. Her daughter missing out on her senior year. Garris says it's time for change. If we are healthy, let us get the virus. Let, let the virus run its course, okay? Because this virus is not deadly. It's not killing health people. Uh, the state government wants to convince us that they're protecting us. We kind of wonder what they're protecting us from. In January, Tom Heaney says he had the coronavirus. Oh yeah, I almost died from it. Yeah, yeah, filled up both lungs. He tells me he understands the seriousness of the pandemic, but a blanket order for the entire state does not work. But maybe lift it for the rest of these people so they can go back to work. We understand the health risks. We understand the need to take care of each other. But we also understand the need to keep the economy going, to keep providing for our families. And quite frankly, we know how to do that best, Governor, not you. Tyler Miller says message after message went unanswered from the governor's office. So he organized this rally. He says standing up for what he believes is government overstep is worth the risk for himself and this crowd. We have a country that is founded on the concept of liberty, and we have a constitution to, that's designed to limit government. Reporting in Olympia, AJ Janivel, Q13 News.